So Hugo, as you push the boulder out of the way, there is a violent sound of scraping stone on stone. Uh, uh. And you look into you look into this uh, the dark ended room. Uh, this being the darkest of the uh, like domed chambers you've passed through thus far. Um, and looking into it, you see you're surprised for a second as you see a uh, the skeleton of what appears to be like a dinosaur or a dragon or well no it literally has to be a dragon as its wings are outstretched and its face is like 10 feet behind the boulder you just pushed away and as you watch it's uh its eyes and nose flare up with fire and smoke and there's a violent rumbling all around you as you hear uh speaking in giant who dares approach me do i see anyone else in the room roll perception uh, 29. You have a very specific angle on this room, Takeshi. As what? you, uh, as you look up and you, like, look into, it, it is a circular room beyond you. Uh, and right. you're against one wall of the room you're in, so you can, like, see the part, uh, the, the part of the circle that could be said to be behind where the boulder was. Like, hiding mm -hmm. around the corner, almost. Uh, and crouched there about, like, like in, a, in, a, shit. <laughs> in, 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 like, a little ball, uh, sits a humanoid figure with a weirdly shaped head. I will, um, pull out one of my sling, uh, uh -huh. bullets, infuse light onto it, and just fucking yeet it at the guy. <laughs> okay. It flies, <laughs> hits them in the head, and you hear, ow, hey, what? Oh, no, figure... Aaron, Aaron, Aaron. That's uh, Sharpshooter. <laughs> That's oh, Sharpshooter. Go ahead. Go ahead. Uh, Aqua, I believe... No, it's that one. Uh, 29 to hit. Oh, no, no. Just 10. Just 10. Sorry. Ooh, looked at the wrong one. Just 10. Uh-huh. Does that hit? Yeah. Oh, it does 18. Wait, wait, oh, wait. 10. Just 10? Just 10. I rolled really oh, bad. Oh, no, that does not hit. It flies okay. past, but it is glowing with light. Go. I, honestly, all of you... Uh, with the light and, like, Takeshi very clearly having seen something, you all move to one side. Uh, and you can see sitting there is a uh, is a figure uh, clad in, like, a greenish-brown robe, uh, a beautiful medallion around their neck. Uh, but most notably is the fact that this person's head is a gourd. Um, it, is a, <laughs> it is specifically a, uh, a like, whitish, yellowish, pale gourd uh, and it's one of those ones that has like the curly stem so it almost looks like their head is like a pirate hook although less pronounced uh and so, they turn to you as the light flies in and go oh come on that was a good one i've been working on that for months wait who are you uh, and this uh, is hey. in common uh How's i go going? by the name of adrin uh, this is hugo takeshi and Babylon, probably you've heard, I probably you probably met Babylon before. I don't know. Uh, no. I'm I'm assuming they don't seem aggressive. No, not really. They just look like mildly put off. I'm gonna. All right, I'm gonna, where's your boss? I'm, I'm gonna pull out my notebook and get uncomfortably close to them as they start taking sketches. <laughs> uh, I'm sorry. Hello, who are you? I'm I'm just ignoring them. I'm, Man, I'm trying to find where the noise right is now. coming from. What'd you say, Luke? I wish I was Sam Hain right now. <laughs> Let's meditate. Right, that you. <laughs> yeah. right that is like, oh, um, well, I, I haven't even started the, the heat yet. Um, if you'd like to get inside, the water's not even boiling. Um, I think I'll pass. Um, it's very um, hot. Oh, right. Um, yeah. Very well, then. We, we can do it here, I suppose. Um, would you like to get in, or just on the ground? I, I'll, I'll stay uh, here. Okay, Where, fair enough. All right. Um, well, I can tell you some of the prayers my mother uh, told me as a as a child to to Lord Surtur. Why well, we can why start with he, those. Why did he mumble the word mother? That's kind of weird. I don't know. He, he big strong guard man. He 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 don't want to admit that he prayed with his mommy when he was four. I don't know. That was my thought. <laughs> okay. Anyway, that's fine. I don't know. Pathetic. Well, you know, you know, honestly, no, that's, they're giants. They, I feel like their family lineage would be pretty important to them. Right. 
Mm, nah, never mind. No, no. Bad, bad characterization. Yeah, you. My you. mother. I love her. There are many stones flying through the air, and like even as those pelt you, uh, they're reaching down to get more. But in this non-initiative initiative situation, you both have a turn to do something. So. Listen here, monkeys. I mean you no harm. Now stop throwing stones at me. That's good enough. <laughs> Is that a persuasion or an intimidation, Hugo? It's an intimidation. 100%. <laughs> All right, go ahead and roll intimidation. <laughs> Uh, please be good. Hey, look at that. Not bad. That's pretty good. Do I get okay. advantage because I'm holding a massive hammer and it's kind of scary? It's a Actually, scary. that's a really it's good a point. Scary. They're they're okay. smart okay. enough to understand the significance of that. So, that's yeah. Big hammer means big bed. <laughs> you good? Yeah, I walked in there and there was like three pixies and they were trying to take my happiness or something. But then I gave them chrome coins and uh, they let me go. Uh, what what yeah. did it look like? Was it did it look fun? Like a pixie. Oh no, not Just pixie. But the, the where you were. What was it like? Adventurous or was it fun? Uh, it was like a you know normal place. Ah, it, had the fairy I, ring I, did like disintegrated at this point? No, it's still there. I walk out and walk back in. I'm just nothing curious happens. Motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> it was pretty. I, Adrian will uh, will try to. Nah, nothing happened. <laughs> that would have been a much different conversation with uh, Takeshi. <laughs> <laughs> you have to give us something. How is your lives? Are you, do you want do you want your lives or are you good to be dying here? What? I will fucking kill you! Ah, <laughs> uh, crap, crap, guys, we got a bad one. Put him back, put him back. <laughs> I, I prep for if he ever dies. Just so what? You know. Wait, what? What? <laughs> Wait, hold up. I don't like the sound of that. No, what? He means he, he dies. He means he's no. prepared to cast reincarnate. It's all good. Yeah, that's what he's prepared to do. Of course. No, no, what I... What do you no. <laughs> Athena, come here. No, it's, no, it's just something... Nah, it's... it's... Yeah, I've just been collecting pieces of your skin to cast Revive on. I understand. <laughs> All good healers do that. <laughs> After the battle, like, you get fucking, like, a big chunk of flesh cut off, and the druid walks by, and you're like, Oh, that's for me! <laughs> I'll need another one in a few weeks when this one starts to rot. Oh, God. Ew. Better hope we get in a fight by then, or else. Anyway, <laughs> I've been noticing you cast gentle repose a lot on your bag. <laughs> What's that about? Well, Togan's actually a very peaceful place. Very nice people. Um, and there's also a forest that I used to live in, which is actually uh full of monstrosities. Ooh. Oh, did you know that there's a guy in Togan that kicked a dog? Oh, but he's God. dead now, so it's okay. Here. Uh, damn. I no, <laughs> was about to say that sounded heavenly, and then <laughs> now I'm less sure. But I'm glad you. Now I never want to visit. <laughs> one dog kicking out. <laughs> In all of Ostrov, there is not one dog kicker. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Saya. That was so kind of woo. <laughs> oh my god! The god oh my god! Get you and he dies. Oh, baby. Oh, my God, I do you want you to <laughs> become the master of the forest. Oh, my God. <laughs> Anywho. Right. Anyway. Well, um, this has been a fruitful, and I mean it, fruitful, relationship. Oh, yeah. Um, Zaya, I, 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 am, uh, I am glad you have... Uh, you don't share the... Oh, Aaron. As Takeshi barely opens one of his eyes, which I feel like it's canon that he has to keep them shut as to not die of of overload of information. Um, does he sense we're being watched by someone possibly invisible? <laughs> you know, it's hmm. it's for for narrative purposes. Ordinarily, I would draw the line at a literally intangible creature being detectable. But right. Screw it. You know, there's a the, the he he's very keenly aware of the direction the sun is shining. I mean, I I also feel like there's probably a level of like absolute malice being um targeted at Takeshi. He, 
<laughs> oh, I feel it, it is a mixture. It, it's it's just a tinge of light out of the corner of his eye that isn't coming from the direction of the sun and staring mm-hmm. in that direction. The there's a roughly horse shaped area of air oh. that just feels angry. Oh, <laughs> real weird. Yeah. <laughs> you know, I'll, just, I'll just have I'll, I'll just coincidentally cast see invisibility at the same time. Um, there's a uh, there is a floating. Uh, intangible, translucent unicorn over there that is literally like, like the the muscles and tendons are standing out, and it is physically <laughs> vibrating with rage. <laughs> it's just slowly corrupting into a nightmare. I is just um, a better leader. Oh my god! Right. Well, <laughs> I um, I I I'll just uh, 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 seeing this right. I'll be like, well, um. You know, you know, for all your, and I do mean this in a kind way, your shortcomings as a leader, which is to be expected from anyone new to it, at least you are intelligent enough, you are wise enough to realize that your position in a a moral standing uh, isn't necessarily the correct one or the only one. And that, and I'll just, like, stare at him at that point. <laughs> and that, when one is zealous in their belief system, they can be pretty fucking useless and die. <laughs> does, she has, does she notice Mashi on, her, on his head? Ooh! I mean, doesn't Mashi blend in? True. Yeah, but yeah. he... Ca- she, she, she's still dealing with the cat. fact that she's, like, not non-existent anymore. So not maybe in a bit. But I'm pretty sure Mashi like... would know to recognize her though. That's true. Mashi is autonomous at this point. Oh hey, I'm pretty intelligent now. Right? Yeah. Hey Kulada. Actually, he knows her name now. He's smart enough to remember her name instead of just being like, oh yeah, mom. I I think. Uh, <laughs> hey Kulada, it's Mommy. me. And she's like, what? Mashi? Um. How long has it been? Oh, uh, my friend here said like couple thousand years or something oh by the spirits yeah it's a pretty long time <laughs> um, and, yeah. um okay so i cast right. enlarge okay so he okay. eats walls sure so if you go you're not like the size of a giant so like you're up to their knees instead of up to their like i'll, I'll pull out uh, so I, i'll pull out this little uh voice modulator um and then I will pull out my all-purpose tool and, like, plug it into the side I'm casting okay. Thaumaturgy to uh, multiply the sound of my voice by twice. Okay. Uh, hi, you fucking scum. Let's see which one of you can actually beat this fucking toddler, huh? Oh. Anyone strong enough to come in there? Or are you all little sissies? An arm wrestling contest we have here! A a particularly burly giant with, like, tattoos on his bare <laughs> arms uh, stands up and is like, Come on, give me. <laughs> is this a joke, littling? The Where only the joke kid? here is you! You can't even be the toddler! Boom, 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 boom. <laughs> Where's the baby? <laughs> I'm right here, buddy. <laughs> <laughs> nice voice. <sighs> this little guy, and he like bends down to pick you up, and like does, but is it's like it, it requires <laughs> most of his strength to do so, which he obviously wasn't <laughs> expecting. And he's like, uh, and he just boom puts you down on the table, which like creaks and buckles underneath of you. Well, we doing this, and he sits down can, in a chair. Yeah, I can hear your cowardice. Look at this, ladies, gentlemen! We have a big burly coward here looking at the toddler! <laughs> the, like, three three other giants that were, like, at this same guy's table, like, start laughing, like, uh... Oh, what's a good giant name? Where's my notes? 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 <laughs> He's actually Zotog. Kind of... Get him, Zotog! Yeah, you got him, Zotog! It's literally a child! <laughs> <laughs> All right, Hugo, strength off as Zotor puts up his massive, like literally his bicep is like the the diameter of so that would the be that would be after Just so you know, 
makes sense. Athletics. Well, athletics is one less, but whatever. It's fine. Mm -hmm. No, it's not. It be. Oh your yeah, it's also plus, plus ten. Oh god, you're right. <laughs> let me see. Let me see what the strength on a. Let me see what the strength on a storm giant is, and then increase it by like two. Forty-six. This is literally the scene where Gon is like in Hunter Hunter. Oh, where he's no, like doing no, the whole no, thing. I, you, you think that isn't where I just got this? <laughs> <laughs> so he rolls a thirty-three, actually. But I got a forty-six. Yeah, no, you got a forty-six. So he, uh, so as you put your arms together, and he like. Literally, you are having to stand up to do this, Hugo, because, like, his forearm is, when it's upright, like, in arm wrestling position, as tall as your enlarged self. What was his um, name again? Zortop? Z Zotog. Zotog. But, uh, so his friends, you can hear him in the back, uh, in the back ch chanting, like, Zotog, 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 and Zotog himself is, like, his dark grayish blue skin is turning red as he, like, is putting <laughs> all of his force into trying to force your hand down and to his credit you it's requiring yeah it's requiring a lot of exertion on your end too but after like after like 20 seconds of his arm slowly mm -hmm. tilting down and down and down you finally boom succeed and as his arm hits the ground the table like cracks in that spot and a piece of it splinter to the ground and for a second the whole tavern is silent and then one of his friends shout Zotog can't beat a baby! And the entire tavern starts <laughs> guffawing. As people Zotog! are like... Zotog! Weaker than a toddler! <laughs> um, and I guess since it hasn't technically used its action yet, it will use its action to try to escape. Hey, look at that, it rolled a natural four. Cool, alright. <laughs> Hugo, it's now your turn. <laughs> hey, uh, guys. Uh, I guess you beat it up now. Uh... Well, no, you you still have a free hand, oh, mother. You can oh, let me, you yeah. can pick this bitch. Yeah. <laughs> sure you, can, you can. Yeah, uh... you, know, you effectively have it viced just between like your hand and like the muscle of your forearm. I just I imagine this thing is like it, it's trying to s sign to its compatriots what's going on, and these two meaty hands descend out of nowhere, <laughs> grab it by the head, uh... and just. Yank it upwards where you see like yep. the wings start being sheared off as they're pulled into something not big enough. Oh, buddy. <laughs> it's a glorious sight to behold. Yeah. Alright, I didn't really think this one through. What What do we do next? Go, man. Uh, oh, sorry. Go ahead. Uh, I'm not very good at this. <clears throat> um, what are you guys arguing about? I should be in charge. Why should you be in charge? Hey, I don't think anyone should be in charge. Let's talk to this Hugo guy. No, let's talk to Hamzad. Uh, all right, this is this getting out of hand. Well. And uh, yeah, um, but hmm. but you no, know, but this is but. This, but this is one of those moments Ooh. I wish Takeshi was here. He he would know what to do. <laughs> <laughs> Wow, guys, you seem, pretty, you. you seem pretty dependent on, on, like, one guy. Like, come on now. You, no, you're, what? you're interesting people what with you your mean? own decision making. Okay, you know what? Okay, fine, fine. Listen, everyone, <laughs> can you guys just uh, tone it down for a bit? Roll persuasion? Performance, maybe? for Better idea. Theory. Better idea. What do I get? Then you suck. Look at that. Um, so you are to prevent me from flying away then? Yeah. Um, alright. <laughs> and he tries to fly away. Uh, Hugo, do rage though. Yeah, yeah, yeah. For sure. Rage, rage. Oh, well, I don't even need to. Because I always get advantage. <laughs> but... Oh my god. <laughs> I mean, let me check his strength score. I don't think he's capable. Actually, I... he is. Uh, wait. Oh, no, he couldn't. He has a plus 9 to strength, but, like, no. That means he can roll a maximum of a 29. <laughs> yeah. 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 <laughs> so, yeah, I mean, Calibus Actually, watches incredibly impressed as Zyre is incapable of getting, like, like, he gets off the ground, but 
Hugo you just grab his leg so, and he just can't move. I, I love I love the idea that he doesn't even get that. Like it's a forty one if he raged, it's a thirty five if he didn't. Mm -hmm. I, I love the idea that like you know how cats right before they jump they like hunch down. Oh. <laughs> I love the idea that it's a similar thing with dragons where they push off. And uh -huh. as he's hunched down, you just see Hugo, like, reach up and pull. <laughs> and that moment, you see, like, like worry on his face as his back is, like, twerking inwards. <laughs> and he's unable to, like, pop. Um, all right, you made your point. That's enough. That's enough. That's enough. As he, like, breathes lightning out of his mouth. And Caldus is like, Robo, chill, homie. <laughs> that, um, I like these can... shields. Yeah, that's pretty good. As you, as you bring it down over its head, and it just crumbles into a pile of i mean you know technically zombie it gets a con save okay it <laughs> dies <laughs> <laughs> oh dear. hey anyone want to fight me i do says tiberius <laughs> oh okay well i guess i was all right that's fine <laughs> <laughs> as hugo yawns yet again <sighs> all right <laughs> you roll first Hugo as uh, Tiberius climbs into the ring all excited <laughs> all excited um, wait wait let I me mean... let me look at let me look at the rolls I I, yeah, I, no, I by all means hey that was a good roll yeah, he's pretty good oh I I just love the idea of like Tiberius runs up and just it's a solid just Hugo just steps oh, out of the way. <laughs> and then he's like <laughs> <laughs> it doesn't move as if he were a several ton cube of lead or something um and then hugo just kind of like picks him up walks to the edge and drops him <laughs> ah. oh um right tiger says it's like everyone is laughing uh well well fought good good game i don't think we need to do more oh okay uh you are quite well versed in that uh my gods uh, thank you. I can see why you're in trouble. Hmm? Oh yeah, uh, as, uh, you, uh, you you said you got me a gift. Um, here, Philly. Wait, is Philly here? Philly's here. Yeah. Right? Oh, wow. Can I have Philly's one of your like curry the crowd. Oh, <sighs> fine. Here, you can take the white one. Can't even use it anyway. And he hands you a white crayon. All right. Um, would white show up on the great axe? On my great axe? Yeah, sure. I'm gonna draw. Uh, to, uh, from Hugo to <laughs> Tiberius, but it's gonna be spelled like really weird. <laughs> Wait, hold up. Let's see. A and when, and probably goblin Tiberius. or giant, right? Yeah, oh, I yeah, think it would be giant, giant for sure. Yeah. <laughs> it would be Tiberius. 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 <laughs> Tiberius. <Tiberse. laughs> sure. <laughs> Uh, here you go. I'll give him my great axe. Okay. Where did I'll you get this great axe? Uh, this is the the starter one I had, the original. Oh right. Okay. As he uh, as he takes the great axe and he's able to hold it comfortably, but not being it's versed a, in. It's a regular. Yeah. Oh yeah. That's yeah. Right. Sorry. Not being versed in two-handed weapons. Uh, just kind of like holds it. Ah. Yes. My goodness. Thank you. Uh, what are these markings here? Oh. Uh, you can't read. <laughs> uh, not this. Is this, uh... Oh. Looks like Draconic? Oh, sorry. Uh, that's giant. It oh. it says, from Hugo to Tiberius. Oh, oh, that's uh, too right. kind. Well, ah, uh, gods, I wish I hadn't given, uh, the, the present I offered you. I don't know, gave it's fine. to Takeshi. Um, oh. well, let's the... Oh. He'll, he'll be able to give it to you when you see right. him again. When he yeah. returns. Yeah, unless well, he dies. <laughs> unless he, but he won't die. He'll succeed. I'm. Of course sure. you will. Okay. Well, have a good one. And Takeshi, you unblink. Hugo and Adrian, as I described, you, you, you guys. Uh, 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 you just enjoy. watched him. You just blinked. How'd it go? <laughs> he just blinked. You don't know what, how anything went. <laughs> he took the book nah, and blinked. I mean, I mean, obviously he went somewhere. Come on, in. <laughs> so Takeshi, as you, as you touch a book and blink, and Adrian, you watch him do this, and Hugo goes, so how'd it go? <laughs> Did you have a good blink? <laughs> I mean, he teleported somewhere. I mean, it's kind of obvious. I mean, whatever. Hugo's yeah, Hugo, kind of big brain. Hugo's dumb sometimes, though. 
I'm saying, like, Roll but perception, it's still... Hugo. Roll perception. See if you caught me teleporting out and teleporting back in. Oh, uh, got you. Hold up. See if you caught when time Yo, we got was. a 10. That's pretty uh, good. Yeah, you both caught it. Wait, time wait, let's, let's see if Takeshi would have seen time pause. Ah. Let's see if I felt it in my muscles. No, he was. It's vanished because I'm cool. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you, you, you flexed Hugo, and yeah. you felt the blood throw flow through your muscles like stop as the momentum of your blood cells reset. You're like ah, time pause. Uh -huh. <laughs> so T Takeshi Takeshi wakes up from a, a sleepless night uh, after only getting about half an hour of sleep, going <gasps> oh shit, I didn't write down the plan and give it to them. <laughs> It'll work out. <laughs> it always does. <laughs> I'm sure that won't be an issue at <laughs> all. I mean, it wasn't. But it's just, Hugo, Hugo is chara charismatic enough to, um, everyone will just believe him if he has the cube. I know it. Right. <laughs> Lead man. Lead man, that's me. Let me tell you the story of how I died. Right. Ooh, you Lord. see, long ago, when I was alive on this world, leading... The, leading this forest, keeping its people in line, keeping them safe, keeping them on the path of goodness, in the name of the Summer Queen and the gods of purity and light. I had different opinions, wrong opinions I now know, about mortals like yourself, about humanoid beings with morals, as they call them. And do you Did know he just happened? say he doesn't have morals? That's not what I meant. Uh, okay. <laughs> sorry. sorry, I was like, did he just say he doesn't have morals? <laughs> not what I meant. Uh, with, uh, with what I meant was uh, relative morals, as they call them. And I let my guard down. I did. There were events going on over the mountains, wars and whatnot, but I stayed out of them. I let the mortals do what they want. And when a blue-haired young man with a wizard's robe walked into my grove, and he said hello, he was just here to pay his respects. And I scanned him, and you know what? His soul was evil. But I said... Uh, sorry. Okay, my... Yeah, okay, whatever, Dad. Sorry, I'm, I'm a character that yells. Just, oh my gosh, everyone's coming in the room during this scene. Ahem. <laughs> but they Is go Noah still watching you? No, he left. Uh but they go. <laughs> and do you know what I said? Oh well he's alone, and even the most pure soul can be redeemed. Perhaps he can find some solace here. Perhaps I can teach him things about the truth and the right. And do you know what he did? He turned into a dragon and killed me immediately. And that is why I don't trust you, lead man. Make sure. And considering your friend here with the orange hair has just yelled at me and told me about how much he hates me. Well, rightfully so. Put you all around. Mm -hmm. Okay. And right. honestly, I believe that's all I have to say on the matter. If and Oris looks to everyone around again. If you would please remove not Sire, just these two, please, everyone. We're going to. Right. We're going to fight a war. Wait, wait. How how is it the humans' fault? You let a dragon in. <laughs> I. The point is that the that creatures sense. like this, no, creatures no. who aren't as perfect as myself, did she... the dragon have to disguise himself to kill you? Is that is it because he was a human that you hate humans, or was it he was a dragon? I'm. I'm not straightforward on that regard. You know, I'm Oris sorry. Who is talking? Sense. Can Dad, as all as he uh, as he begins to lead you towards the largest tree at the center of the place. Um, yes, it's it's been honestly almost forever since we've had. Well, that's not entirely true. We've had. It's been a while since we've had um, humanoid guests, I suppose. Um, so it <sighs> is a pleasure. Um, I do hope, and he turns to you all. I do hope you're fine with, um, fruits. That's pretty much what we eat here. Um, but we make the greatest right, fruit salad. Uh, I'm sure well, I'm, I'm pretty much a vegetarian. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sure you are. 
<laughs> Oof. Ah, a man after my own heart. Outstanding. And Oris with the most painfully hideous, honestly, like strained grin a horse could possibly make. <laughs> stares like at the three grin. of you. All right. Well, I hope it works for everyone then. Goodbye. I'm off to the seven heavens where I'm appreciated. I Enough. will leave this in the hands of my successor. Sire, I officially consider your training complete. And I'll, I'll, I'll oh, ask, okay. first. I also I've seen a unicorn make that face okay. before. It looks like a hag to me. Okay, Adrian, last words. Adrian wants uh, to say one last it. thing. Yeah, no, you got it. You know, uh, my friend Takeshi. I have some problems with him, but even he would be a better leader than you would ever be. Oh, oh, oh. He's a mortal. Oh. Evil! <laughs> Evil? <laughs> Critical hit to the ego. And with that, Oris, with as much dignity as they know how to muster, which in this scenario is none, fades into the Feywood Grove. With a fart. <laughs> <laughs> And disappears. So yeah, that's pretty much all the audio I I had. Uh, but I want to end this video saying that I had a really fun time making these animatics. It was a pretty much a fun way to share memories of my friend's D and D campaign. It's also cool to see that uh, people that were not even part of the campaign really seem to really enjoy it. There's someone that is a small Twitch streamer. She does art streams. And she actually, like, told me uh, during her stream that she loved my videos. By the way, I love your videos. I have been catching up on those, and those are hysterical. And there are some days where it's like, I really needed that laugh, and that was good. Just the fun you guys have. If you guys are into, like, art streams, I do recommend checking her out. Uh, she and her husband are really fun to talk to. I will say that, if anything, I maybe, you know, I have all these compilations. I have all the, I still have the audio. Maybe if I feel like it, maybe I'll keep making more of these, but I'm not so sure. I do plan on uh, making an animatic of Adrian and Tiberius' uh, father, Sumo Wrestling. There's part of me that really wants someone else to do it, because I want someone who's really, you know, professional at uh, art could do, that would, like, do way better than me. Because I do want to make it a bit epic. Um... But who knows? That might just be an idea and might not happen. Um, but yeah, that's pretty much it. Maybe I might make some more animatics. Maybe for the next campaign, but who knows? I don't think I'm going to completely do it. That's pretty much it. Um, thanks for watching my videos. I guess, see ya.